A local New Hampshire farmer, Mark Roby is the proud steward of his family's sixth-generation farm known as Roby Farms. Nestled in Piermont on the border with Vermont in the heart of New England, this farm holds a space for candidates during the New Hampshire primaries. So, so the Roby Farm um, has been here since um, 1870. Um, I'm the, the sixth generation. My kids who work in the farm, they're, they're the seventh generation. Roby's small farm hosts animals, including cows for his raw milk production, cheese, and unique dairy products. He also sells eggs from his laying hens, has pigs, and a plentiful amount grain and hay. New Hampshire, renowned as the first in the nation primary state, plays a significant role in shaping the American electoral process. Roby's farm store has become a vital stop on the campaign trail, where presidential hopefuls from various parties engage with voters. I don't, I don't know that we've always had Republicans here. I think we've had Democrats. At least, you know, the, the, the Roby country store is open to both. Um, you know, we're, we're totally open to... You can disagree with me and I'll still love you. When asked about his animal's political party preference, he pointed straight to their preferred candidate. I think if my animals could vote, they would vote for me. Like, who, who would treat them better, you know? They're, they're, you know I, honestly, I'm the one who feeds them, right? Like, like, like they're in a good economy. Their needs are taken care of. They don't have to struggle. They don't have to, to work hard, you know, by the sweat of their brow. In the upcoming primaries, a diverse array of candidates, including former President Donald Trump and former South Carolina Governor Nikki Haley, seek the support of New Hampshire's voters.